वेलकम टू जी जे आई एम डी गुजरावाला गुरु नानक इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ मैनेजमेंट एंड टेक्नोलॉजी जी जे एन आई एम टी इज़ वन ऑफ द लीडिंग एंड द ओल्डेस्ट टेक्निकल कॉलेज इन पंजाब स्टेट ऑफ इंडिया वी आर फॉर्चुनेट टू बी पार्ट ऑफ दिस टीम आई एम डॉक्टर हरप्रीत सिंह फ्रॉम जी जे एन एम टी इट सेल्फ so today we'll be discussing about motivation of self i'm not talking about self motivation here i'm talking about motivation of self self motivation means for me how i take it as self motivation is when you are self motivated to do a task at a particular time for a particular task only for a particular objective only motivation of self means that you stay motivated for always you keep yourself motivated for always you in you stays motivated so what we need to do for that the first of all is communicate with yourself regularly talk to yourself talk to yourself mean understand you yourself one whatever you want to do in next 5 years decide formally and talk to yourself whatever you want to be in the next 10 years talk to yourself whatever position you must have down the line 20 years from now talk to yourself means whatever your strengths are whatever your objectives are whatever you can do whatever you need to do talk to yourself communicate with yourself regularly regularly means don't stray away from yourself in our daily life whenever any task is given to us by our seniors or we feel that we are to do that task ourselves we use many phrases are in in our vernacular languages for example in punjabi language we use the word chal chhad par so whenever any task is given to us we say chal chhad par let's leave it dekhi jaogi let's see kal kar lavange we'll do it tomorrow bade din pe ne there are so many days left why to do it right now dekhde hain shayad bina kuch kitne hi sar jaye let's see if it is not needed to do it at all so like this one we use so many phrases in our life whenever any task is done so just count how many time you use these kinds of phrases more you use it means you are not motivated all the time less you use it means your self is motivated most of the times so just count the frequency how many times you use these kinds of phrases i attended one of the sessions earlier in my career and i remember a beautiful expression that was kfp kfp again the term kya fark padta hai ki fark pehna so whenever we are to do something and we nullify the significance or the importance of the same we say kfp kya fark padta hai but after a passage of time we understand that kfp led to bfp means bahut fark padta hai we lost because we ignored earlier so then we understand bfp bahut fark padta hai and when we understand bahut fark padta hai it makes a difference right kfp means how how much difference it makes bfp means how much different it makes when we understand how much different it makes so again we go back to kfp kitna fark padta hai it really makes a big difference so this kind of approach in life is not good do the task as one go complete it there and then do not postpone the things more you will postpone more you will lose if you understand this you will stay motivated many people feel that they are not good enough for anything 
for example any student is to make any presentation somewhere and he feels that he is not good enough for making a presentation before others and if he making any any presentation uh, he may not be as good as others are there and he may expose himself to others and others will get to know that oh oh he is incompetent to make a presentation so this kind of deepest fear is there in the mind of the students if you have got this this kind of deepest fear in your mind please realize that you are the best and whatever best you can do you must do it not doing is bad doing at least whatever best you can do is always better approach now secret of empowering the self never try to change yourself rather identify and express the real self most of the times we imitate or we copy others we want to do whatever others do we want to imitate their style and so on mind it that you are unique you have your own methods until unless you are trained maybe self training or by trained by other experts don't try to change yourself rather you must identify what you have in you you must know you in you and then express the you in you the real self so express it means do whatever you know the best way do it we say the people are strong people strong means those who gain victory over others is strong but who gains victory over himself is powerful so if you can gain victory over yourself means your worries your vexes your self doubts and so on if you can gain victory over your self doubts you are powerful means you can influence others as edison said tolerate your failures so edison could not make bulb after say 1000 attempts he was asked that did you feel bored did you feel uh, discouraged that you are not able to make a bulb he said if i tried 1000 times 9999 times i knew how not to make a bulb so the failures have lessons also failures have rather better lessons always failures always teaches you in a better and critical manner and the learnings of failure are always longer lasting so don't tol- don't just just tolerate failure for being failure enjoy your failure don't expect or hope or desire what is maximum acceptable rather what is minimum possible to be expected so keep your expectations in control do dream big it's not that don't dream do dream big but don't dream beyond your reach you understand yourself and then understand that you are to achieve that don't play wrestling with your problems means keep on thinking keep on thinking what the problem you are facing you feel more bewildered perplexed confused and rather you just forget your problems for the time being if you are not able to find a immediate solution for your given problem a day will come with a sudden answer right so there may be problems if those problems are there don't don't keep on thinking about those problems the problems are always temporary in nature no problem is permanent in life so there may not be an immediate solution for that problem the problem solution may be not available today but it will definitely come to your way so wait for the right occasion don't keep on thinking about your problems all the time think of solutions also another part is don't worry so much when you worry whatever you cannot achieve right for example any student is worried about being the university topper all the time 
right or any researcher is worried about the the results of his research and so on you really cannot do anything while while you are worrying so much just resolve rather the solution centric approach towards being worrisome is say i'll handle it say i'll do it i can do it then i'll do it so i'll handle it that kind of approach is always better a normal saying what others find difficult to do is talent and if anyone cannot do anything is for example you say that uh, any talented person feels that this is not possible right for example there are so many tennis players all of them are talented and if they talented people feel that they cannot be world number 1 right so they think that it is impossible to be number 1 even if they are very talented but those who feel that they can be number 1 by overcoming the feeling of that impossibility they are called genius there are some persons to whom rank gives the status for example suppose any ceo is there because he is having that rank of ceo so he is having that status so he enjoys that status because of that position he has in that organization or society but there are others who give status to their rank there can be any person i remember a pn working in my uh, as my colleague somewhere he was so honest so sincere so hard working never felt any need to give him any instruction for doing anything he was so respectful and whatever he used to say other used to accept him there and then only if he says anything let's accept that so he was not having any rank in the organization but he had given a status to his rank by being honest by being hard working by being sincere and so on so as gb shaw says take care to get what you like otherwise you will be forced to like what you get this is my favorite quote from gb shaw's work he says whatever you like you must take care of that otherwise you must be forced to like what you get if you could not get an mba admission will say no problem uh, mba was not that good enough mcom is okay so in fact we wanted to do mba but we went for mcom just be- because we are forced to like uh, mcom only so better that you you set your objectives you work hard for achieving those objectives you clarify that yes mba means mba and mba is the best thing so take care to get mba only so if you have a team make your team to feel empowered keep them motivated if your team or family is motivated and feeling empowered you will stay motivated all the time as well so make your team members that they are needed they are part of important team so when they feel needed they will always stay motivated and empowered and subsequently you will also feel motivated all the time so position yourself in the organization in a organized manner organization manner means that you understand your responsibilities you delegate your responsibilities to others but keep on taking those responsibilities which others feel are impossible so slowly you will feel indispensable in the organization do indispensability is just a misnomer but somehow to understand is that you are feeling ultimately very very important so when you are feeling important in the organization you stay motivated similarly we for example the students when the exams are coming near, nearby they feel that they have lost the time now it is not possible to do anything 
they have done the wrong part already they have missed only a lesser time is available and so on so don't worry for the time you have already wasted rather worry for the time just left just still available with you to utilize so think of the time available whatever is lost is lost as one of the authors my favorite authors bui b u o e e bui said uh, when all all else is lost future still remains so even if all else has already been lost don't worry future still remains so time available should be utilized properly the time lost should not be worried upon much then celebrate your success and failure both success for its taste and failure for all that hard work and sincerity you put because you have been hard working you have been sincere you have done your best you you did whatever was within your capacity so you must celebrate for all that effort also it's not that the success is enjoyed for the final achievement success is enjoyed or the failure is enjoyed for the sincere journey you have undertaken so enjoy 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 means celebrate both your success and failure very very important do something sometime which makes you feel winner so whatever you do in your daily life routine life is okay but sometimes do something which others feel that it's a surprise for them means you do something in a such a unique manner which was not expected from you and then you will feel a winner so do something sometime which makes you feel winner thank you very much please